Hey, welcome to today's Daily Sprint. We're talking about increasing purpose, passion, and meaning. And today we're talking about what personal development is because there's self-care, which a lot of, I think a lot of people um, confuse with personal development. There's, which could be part of self-care. I was going to say quiet time, um, de-stress time. That probably could be lumped in with self-care. But then there is personal development. And then there's mindset development. I think a lot of people put things in like working out in the personal development category and that should go in the self-care category. So they think like, oh yeah, I do a lot of personal development. How do you know what personal development really is? Personal development works on the mind. Okay, so like I said, mindset development. So I used to say that, hey, if you want to have something, go out and do what other people that have, that you want, go and do what they do, okay? So if I want to level up in business, I need to find someone who's better in business than I am and then follow their lead. That is tr a true to an extent, but it's more so you want to think like people who have what you want to think. That's what really needs to happen because what that person is doing to get good at business probably isn't anything crazy, okay? But it's getting them to do, getting ourselves to do what we already know instead of looking for things we don't know how to do. That is personal development. So when you plug into people, focus less on the technical side. Like, you know, say that you want to plug into someone uh, because you want to be able to work out like they work out. Look less at the movements and everything that they're doing and look more at their beliefs, their mindset of going into that workout, their mindset outside of the gym. Because it's their mindset that is really why they're successful in these areas of life. So again, and that's why I think plugging into people that have what you want is key to develop that mindset because a book can't really teach that, a podcast can. Like I follow a lot, of, I listen to a lot of podcasts from, from, um, from folks, but there's not a whole lot of interaction and the books and the podcast can't call you out. They can't call you out and say, that's a broke mindset. That might be your truth. It's not just the truth. So that's why and I'm not saying don't do the, the other things for personal development, but that's why it's key that you have human beings in your life. And that's humbling because you have to say, wow, this person has what I want. I need to then bring value to them for us to have a dial, a, a conversation back and forth or pay them or hire a mindset coach. Okay. But if you don't want to hire a mindset coach or business to, uh, a business mentor, then you need to plug into those people and then provide value for them so that they want to in turn plug into you. So hey, I'd love to know in the comments who you plug into, who is a mentor that you plug into and that you share value with. Thanks for tuning in.